2017 marks the centennial of the United States' entry into World War I. It was the war that changed the world map, and New Jersey played a key role in it. I'm Lieutenant Governor Kim Guadano, and I'm proud to present this centennial spotlight on New Jersey and the Great War. Join me in remembering the three million troops who passed through the port in Hoboken on their way to the front. Celebrate the 100th anniversary of Fort Dix, one of 16 National Army training camps built in 1917 to train World War I soldiers. Salute the indomitable spirit of the American Doughboy. And take a moment in silence to remember a notorious act of sabotage in Jersey City, a terrible explosion that scarred the Statue of Liberty forever. Reflect on the Great War's deadly toll at memorials in towns and cities across the state. During this centennial year, let's pay tribute to the bravery of our own native sons and daughters, including the poet Joyce Kilmer, who enlisted just days after the United States entered the war and was killed in action on the battlefield in France in 1918. And Trenton native Needham Roberts, one of the first Americans to receive the French Croix de Guerre for heroism in battle. New Jersey shines a light in the valor and sacrifice of our soldiers and our sailors and the state's contributions to the Allied victory. Now, a century later, it's time to discover the more than 160 sites across our state. I encourage you to visit your local World War I monument soon and take part in the centennial events happening across New Jersey in the coming year.